at Daytona today in the Nationwide Series. We'll see if he gets number seven. Yeah, you know, when we saw Dale Earnhardt doing that, we thought, wow, that'll never happen again. And here, Tony Stewart is in position to make it happen once again. Yeah, and all the while, he still hasn't won a 500. And just about the way it was with Earnhardt when he won his fifth, uh, fifth race here. That could change the mark, yeah. Good. 19 cars on the lead lap. Two laps to go in a race that's seen 37 lead changes and lots and lots of shuffling up front. Who's going to get to the checkered flag first? The Bush brothers get out front. Joey Logano outside lane in the 20. He's got a push in the draft. That's Trevor Bain in the 60, the Daytona 500 defending winner. Coming back from two laps down, Trevor Bain is. And Stewart boxed in for the moment. Yeah, that's the problem that they have right now. He and Elliott Sadler are tucked up, but they have nowhere to go right now. Could be clear here in just a second, though, to make that run. Yeah, you're pulling away from them a little bit. You're about three off a cut. Looks like Stewart's car. The white flag wrong. is out. Stewart, maybe. The last lap is underway. Who gets back first if there's no accident? I think they're going to have a hard time, even though Logano has a big run, getting back for Kyle Busch right here. I don't know. Looks like they might have a run. They do. Back down. Come back down. Come to back walk. down. Cut the other way. Half a lap to go. Here comes Stewart in the 33 as Logano goes to the point. Three wide in turn four. A squeeze to the outside wall. Trouble in the corner. Hard, vicious crash. Who gets through to win the race? Caution flag has just been called. The race leader is James Butcher in the 30 car. Unbelievable. A heavy, heavy crash. In the final corner of the race, Kyle Busch's car, Trevor Bain, Ricky Stenhouse. It looked like Stewart tried to force it on the outside. Not, a, not quite enough room to make it happen. Well, he had the room. I think that maybe Joey Logano moved up to try to block that progress. There's Kurt Busch. The key, the key to the moment is when the caution was officially called. NASCAR reviewing at the moment in race control. There's Tony Stewart. And we'll wait for confirmation of it, but when I heard NASCAR call the caution on its race control channel, James Busher was out in front of the pack. We'll see. Stewart had an incredible run going into turn three. I actually thought he had something maybe wrong with his car. 